My name is James Heaton and I'm a machine vision engineer here at RDM. RDM has been um, in the business for about 30, 40 years. They've recently been making spoke parts for other companies in the area such as Aston Martin, Jaguar Land Rover, and recently launched a sister company called um, Arigo, which are designers and manufacturers of autonomous vehicles, ranging from um, four-seater pods to 10-seater shuttles. Uh, they're usually used for first and last mile transportation and they also have uh, a third product which is uh, the Auto Dolly which is designed for autonomous baggage handling at airports. This is a very innovative project because it's essentially trying to take an existing autonomous vehicle platform into higher level of autonomy. So what we're trying to do is to eliminate the need for a human sort of supervisor uh, to be there when things go wrong, essentially. So we want the pod to be able to make those decisions autonomously uh, without any need for, uh, for humans to be present. Quite a lot of uh, competition either are the manufacturers of the vehicles or to roll operational actually side of it. As a company, we took a decision to actually bring this all in-house. So all of the vehicles are actually manufactured, actually here in Coventry, and we have engineers here currently working on that. KTP is a self-contained project between a university and um, a company um, in a specific industry and I am a KTP associate so I've been brought in to complete a, a particular project uh, working with both uh, the academics at the university and the management team here at um, RDM. Prior to me joining RDM they'd been using lots of different kinds of sensors on their vehicles and uh, the purpose of this KTP was to was for someone with some uh, machine learning experience to come in and develop a uh, camera-based system to be able to detect objects and control the vehicles. So at the start of the project we set out to achieve um, a few things. The first was to develop a uh, simulation environment. That has been completed and now the next step is to look at uh, developing the, the camera-based perception systems using uh, machine learning. The aim is to make these vehicles safer, cheaper and more reliable, so that only stands to improve the standing of Origo going forward. I think the biggest challenge has been for us academics has been to get in terms with the level of scientific rigor and safety features that need to be uh, built inside these algorithms. Uh, because you know it's all fine and nice when you're just developing a simple little prototype, but when you're actually implementing something on a live vehicle that will be released amongst, amongst real people, uh, you cannot afford anything to go wrong. So for us, proving that the algorithm does what you wanted to do uh, was, was quite a challenge. Working with both the industry and academics uh, means more support whenever I have a problem. For a place like Aston, this type of uh, ethos is kind of, it's almost built in to the fabric of the university. So we have had quite a lot of involvement with industry from almost from the very beginning. All of the work that we end up doing in terms of research uh, either has a very, very strong applied segment or sort of leads towards some strong application area, uh, which means that with all of the work that we do, uh, the end user, you know, the end system that is going to be built is, is always in our minds. So the nice thing about these KTP projects is that it, it's, it takes this idea to the, to the next level, so they fit very well with our understanding of what research is really meant to be doing, you know, meant to be solving real problems. Just being able to prove that you can generate data and use that way that makes the cameras work reliably. Because if we weren't able to use simulation environment to create synthetic data, we'd actually have to be driving around all over the country collecting data. I'm really excited that we've shown that this can work and it produces massive savings uh, for the industry.